Hi everybody, thank you for watching today. So I'm back with a what's in the box video. So these are my design team products that I've been sent from Craft Label. Some of you are probably still getting to know Craft Label, but they were Trim Craft. So if you knew Trim Craft, that's all it is. It's just changed. I'll link their site in the description box below and you can actually now purchase directly from them online. So firstly, I just wanted to show you the packaging, which I really, really liked. So this is a huge, big envelope. You can see the top of it here and it's on craft card and it has this lovely polka dot over it and I'm gonna just cut this down probably here. I reckon I can get a six by six piece of card from this section and then this is just a nice almost 12 by 12 piece and then I have all the same on the back there. So if it comes and you can save it, this is you know really, really lovely, fun, patterned craft card and I love that it is 100% re recyclable there as well. So I just thought that was really nice, something new, and I would share it with you all. So, so first of all, I'm gonna start off with the Dovecraft Essentials range. So they've sent me these eight metal charms, and these are great to put on a card with a little bow. You can pop them on the back of the card or on the front. They look really, really sweet, and I have done that before in past videos. And they also look really nice on the side of any mini albums that you might make, and maybe you sell them. These are lovely little additions just to pop on the spine there. You can see the Made With Love through the center. Like I said, they are metal and you get eight of them. They're really, really sweet. Then they've sent me these alphabet stickers. You get 63 pieces in black and white. It looks like you get three of each of your vowels, A, E, I, O, U, and then you get two of all of your other letters. Like I said, in the black and white there, really nice. I'll definitely be using those. Then they've sent me the printed letter tiles. Now some of you, if you've watched my past What's in the Box videos, the, I've already received the ones in the holographic, the silver and the rose gold. They're really nice and I have used them on projects and I do pull them out every now and then. But now they've done them in rainbow colour. Really love these. You get 153 pieces and they literally are those tiles from that well-known board game. And they look great. And you, if you like to do the home decor where you can kind of have all the names of your family laid out as if you were playing that game and then lots of people like to frame them, you can do that kind of thing with these. But equally, they look lovely on your 3D projects and on your cards. So again, you will see those pop up in future videos. But you get tons there, so they're going to last you a long time. I don't know the amounts of each letter, but I imagine there's a good variety there. I haven't, I've, I have yet to struggle to put a word together with the other ones that I've got. So those are going to be nice to add to my stash. And then I was actually, so although those are lovely, the size of them obviously is bigger. And sometimes if you've got a longer word, it's quite hard to fit onto the card size that you might have. But they've now brought out the mini. <laughs> And I really do think I'm gonna use these so much more because of the size. But the holographic, gold, and then black and white. You get 200 pieces. And the size of these, you're looking at about 12 by 15 mil, or half an inch by about just under five eighths. So they're really nice size. So I'm really pleased that I've got those ones. And um, I think I'm going to pop them in with the other ones with the same colours, just kind of mix them all in. So it might be quite nice as well to have like the larger of the holographic, for example, the start of the word, have it as a larger tile and then do smaller tiles, just kind of mix it up. We'll see. We also popped in this free gift here. So it's Craft Label, our free gift to you. We have exclusively designed these sticker sheets as a thank you for placing an order. They will change regularly, so keep an eye out for new designs. Love the Craft Label team. These particular, this style here, will go really nice with the Chasing Rainbows. First edition paper pad that they brought out probably about 18 months ago now. Really, really sweet. So um, yeah, and they're just great if you like to decorate your planners as well. But the main thing that they sent me and a little squeak came out <laughs> is the brand new Dovecraft premium collection. And it is Butterfly Kisses. So if you're a fan of Dovecraft and their beautiful collections that they bring out, then I don't think you're gonna be disappointed with this one. So this is the eight by eight paper pad. I'm actually glad they sent the eight by eight. The 12 by 12, I do go through, but I find myself with the Dovecraft collections using more of the six by six or the eight by eight. So the eight by eight is gonna be great because I can use it on my five by seven cards as well because I've got the, the height there. So I'm gonna just give you a little look inside this one. Let's just trim the plastic off the side there. Okay, so you've got your little top sheet here and then you have this one which basically gives you an overview of all the papers but that alone is a great paper to have, you know, to use as a background on a card. So yeah, don't get rid of that one, which I'm sure you wouldn't anyway. <laughs> but look at this. Isn't that stunning? Look at all the butterflies with that silver foiling there. Really lovely and it's all on that rich purple background. 
So you get three of each design. You've got this scale here. You could use this on many things. But obviously, mermaid's tail come, obviously jumps out straight away. But great even for a real kind of girly sea theme card as well. I think that'd look really nice. So I love that one. Or a dragon as well. I think that'd look lovely. So you get three again of that one. And then you've got these ones here with the glitter going through the rose there and the butterflies. And you have this one here. Which again has got sparkle through some of the strips there and the butterfly detail. And then you get some great background ones here. So these are just mattes. You don't have any shine or sparkle on these ones. Again with this one here. Isn't that stunning? Absolutely beautiful. Goes really nicely with my nails as well. And then you get this one here. Which that one's kind of got a water lily pattern to it. And then you've got this one here. These are great for fussy cutting as well. So, and again, if you get the 12 by 12, obviously they'll be larger. But that's a really nice size. And I've got lots of butterflies anyway. I've got lots of butterfly dies that I'll be able to coordinate with this paper pad. Lovely geometric print there. Another nice background one. Some of this as well, the colour, this green, I think it's going to work really well with the Garden Delights. Is it Garden Delights? No, Secret Garden, the Dovecraft collection. Again, another favourite of mine, which I still go to now. I actually did do a repeat buy of that one after they sent me the initial collection. I then went and purchased some more bits because it was just so nice. Isn't that lovely? Again, you could fussy cut these, but I just think that's going to look lovely on a card. And then you have this one here. They've done similar designs like this before. Again, really nice if you just maybe buy the paper pad and maybe a few embellishments, which I'll show you in a moment. You've got some lovely sentiments here that you can cut into. So I really do like that one. Special wishes, love, especially for you, with love, just for you. And then you've got the ones there with the rose and the butterfly. I think that's it, yep, so that's the back there. And then with the Dovecraft collections, you always get a decoupage pad. So here is the eight by eight glitter decoupage pad. Again, just gonna take the sides off there. This one here, there's your overview of the decoupage sheets. If anybody's unfamiliar with decoupage, basically decoupage means to layer. And what you do here is you layer up all of these pieces to create really nice toppers. Just follow the numbers. So number one would be the largest one. So that would be the base one. So that's the one you start with. Then you would stick number two on top. And you, the idea is you, you use your foam pads. So number two would go on top, then number three on top. And you'll see you'll start to get a little bit of each one. So that one there has the purple frame. So it will sit on that purple frame, but you'll see the darker purple. Then this one doesn't have a frame at all. So then you'll get to see that as well as that. And then number four is the love. So you'll see the width and then the love will be lifted. And then number five is the butterfly. But you have spares here as well. So you've got all these extras which make great gift tags for 3D projects. Or if you don't want to have a decoupage, you can just have them, you know, like so. Then you have this one here. So again, you just follow the same. So one, two, three. I like this hexagon shape. I really like that style. And again, different toppers here as well. And you'll start to see a lot of inspiration hitting the social media pages of Craft Label. So if you're on Instagram, Facebook, if you go over onto their website, also onto the Craft Blog, which is their blog where they feature a lot of the design team makes and lots of inspirations. And there's free downloads over there as well. So it's worth checking out. This is lovely, it's a gift tag. So again, if you are gonna make gift boxes and gift bags, which you know I'm going to with this collection, to have the tags there ready and in a decoupage is really nice because I've, I've used tags before in the other decoupage kits. So. And you have this one here. This is going to work so well with the 3D kind of card design. So if you've made things like my center panel, I think it was the gatefold, center gatefold card or something like that, that would look lovely as the, the topper that is exposed when you open up the gatefold. Lots of my big showstopper cards, these beautiful toppers in the centers work really well. So. I know there's going to be a few of you out there that will really enjoy using this with those kind of cards. Again, like the way they've built up the roses there. This one here, a dream's Mother's Day. I think whenever you see kind of a, a plant pot of flowers or a, a vase of flowers, it's just Mother's Day, isn't it? So it's certainly one I think I'll be using for Mother's Day this year. So I know I've got a few cards to make for some friends as well. So it's going to get well used. And then... This one here, that's nice with a circle on top of the square there. 
It's different to anything I've had before, that kind of design, so that's nice to use. And again, you can choose, you know, all these, and you, you, you get three of each, yeah, three of each design, so you've got so many sentiments here, you know, to last you, so you'll get, be able to make a lot of things with this. That's really nice. Love that rich purple colour. And then I think this is the last one, and you've got the happy birthday beautiful with the heart there I think that's so sweet really really pretty it's just such nice colours I'm so pleased I've got this one as you can probably tell so that's the butterfly kisses decoupage pad so I can't wait to use that one so they also sent me the matching embellishments to go with this collection so here I have eight holographic butterflies I love these butterflies I've actually had something very similar that I used to buy probably about two years ago when I lived in China I used to go to Walmart and I picked up a load there and when I was sharing them on one of my what did I get lots of people were like oh my gosh I love them but I can't get hold of them or they didn't have them in my Walmart or for my friends because obviously I was living abroad at the time in the UK they were like I can't get these everywhere then I started to see places like The Range start selling similar ones in, under their Craft Sensation brand or whatever it was. And then slowly I've seen other brands kind of trickling it through into their collections. So I'm really pleased that Dovecraft have made these to match the collection. And what I actually like to do with them, so they're stickers with a holographic, but I actually take the top layer off. Let's see if I can do them with these, because they should be the same. Yeah. And they almost look like real butterflies. Isn't that gorgeous? So, you know, you, you've almost got two then because you can have that as a sticker and then you've got this as well to use. Just add a little bit of glue if, you, if it's not as sticky as you would like. And um, yeah, so really you've got 16 butterflies there if you want to do it that way, but, and they look really lovely on your cards or on the top of like a gift box on the lid and things like that, which is what I've, I've kind of done with the past ones on my channel. So I do have a butterfly playlist, I think. Or maybe I thought to do one. Because I know I went through a phase of doing so many butterfly projects. So watch out, there's probably going to be more coming again. But if I do find that playlist, I've got it, I'll link it up here. So they're lovely, really like those ones. Then I've got these here, which are 12 puffy stickers. So what they basically are is there's, a, there's some foam underneath the sticker. So it just gives it that dimension. And you just see all the images there. From the paper pads that I showed you earlier, they've just turned into stickers. So those are really nice. Then silver buttons and I was so pleased to see silver because I have rose gold, I have gold, I've got pinky colour but I haven't got silver and I find I use silver a lot more whether it's with the mirrored cardstock that I use or silver embossing powder so it's going to be really nice to have these buttons so you get 60 silver buttons there so those are nice to add a little bit more texture then I have these which are stunning so these are 37 glitter gems they're faceted and look at all the colour in those they are absolutely gorgeous they are just so pretty and so shiny so those are the yeah, just glittered gems and then I've got some stamps so you've got the happy birthday you've got the rose you've got these flowers which will look really nice colored and then you've got the just for you as well so four clear stamps then I have these ones here which are eight sentiment toppers and I like that they this time have mixed these kind of shapes with these vertical ones as well because usually what they've done in past is they've had them all kind of these shapes, circles or like little squares on one which are great or they've done ones where they've had them all like this. So the fact that they've mixed them up this time I really like because sometimes I want that thin strip to just kind of you know pop in somewhere so yeah it was nice that they done that change. And um, those have all got foam on the backs there as well. Then you've got your butterfly confetti, which is great for your shaker cards. And they're not too small, so if you wanted to just have silver, you could quite easily pick out the silver ones and um, or just use the purple if you want. But again, really nice. They've got two little holes in them as well, so if you wanted to be really creative, you could sew these in like a border effect around a card or something because that's what I thought when I saw them. I thought I like that they've actually put the little holes in them because yeah, you could definitely stitch these onto something. You could stitch them onto a ribbon or something. I think it'd look really nice. So yeah, love those. And you've got some bows. So you've got 20 mini bows. I do like the mini bows. I pop these in with all my other mini bows and it's just nice to have all the different colors, you know, so, but these obviously will go perfectly because that's what they're designed for, but love that hot pink. And again, just works so well with my nail polish today. So <laughs> can't wait to start crafting with all of this. Then I have five ribbons. These are cotton. 
and you've got the rose design then you've got that checked you've got with love the butterfly and then a geometric design at the bottom there then you've got these ones which again these are very similar in the colors as well to the secret garden i think they've done green as well in the secret garden one really nice i use these on lots of the um the makes that I done with that so I know I'm going to use them again 15 flower pearls and you've got foam on the back of those as well and then my favorite is the wooden toppers so you get six in a pack and they're really nice strong wooden toppers aren't they gorgeous and again I always do it but when I see this I think of making a ring wouldn't that look lovely as a ring so I probably will I've got lots of the metal um, actual rings so I can just with a bit of hot glue attach it but I think that will look maybe I should do it that way there we go I think that look really nice as a, as a ring so yeah you get six in that pack and that is everything so thank you again to craft label I really do appreciate this I'm again super thankful that I still get to be on your design team and create wonderful projects using your collections this one's screaming mother's day to me I just can't wait to start making some really nice cards and some 3d projects but first of all I'm going to get it all put away I like to remove all the packaging I recycle as much as I can and then that gives me a clear head to kind of think about what it is I'm going to make with it all but I've got some ideas already so look out for those tutorials because it won't be long till I start sharing them. As always everything will be listed in the description box below and I'll be back very soon. Bye!